Okay, my name is Richard Benjamins. I'm the director of uh, business intelligence in Telefonica Digital. So I'm responsible for capturing all the data of our digital uh, propositions and doing analytics and deliver value to the businesses. So we are here at the, uh, at the European Data Forum because actually I was invited to give a keynote uh, speech, uh, which I delivered uh, today. And uh, big data is very high on the strategy of Telefonica as a group, uh, both to improve our uh, current business, our traditional telco business, but also in the digital space where we actually uh, set up a new business unit around big data. Yeah. Regarding big data in Europe, I think uh, from a data perspective, uh, Europe is ready, but from an exploitation perspective, Europe is not yet ready. There are uh, two main issues. One is uh, data protection, regulation. Um, it's not harmonized uh, across Europe. It's uh, very restrictive and we need to find a proper balance between innovation, data exploitation, new ways of doing business and protecting the privacy of our uh, European citizens. That is, not, uh, that is not clear at the moment. It's much easier elsewhere in the world. So that's where a lot of innovation uh, happens. Secondly, uh, I think Europe is not ready because we are too much oriented towards research and development and we're not paying enough attention to uh, innovation and to bringing it to market. So we are excellent knowledge producers, lots of publications, uh, but we're not able to turn it into a business. Yeah. That's basically the problem with Europe. Yeah, I like to be here at the European Data Forum because actually I met a lot of people who I already know since many years. So it's good to, uh, to maintain uh, your contacts, to see where people are, also, we met some new interesting people, uh, so it's always good of such an event where all people come together around a theme uh, uh, and, to see, uh, and to establish new contacts. Yes, and uh, at the European Data Platform, what I saw is that there is a lot of awareness of the existing challenges. So it's not that, we, that Europe is trying to do things uh, at the blind, but there is a lot of uh, experience in what Europe is doing well and what Europe should improve, and there are relevant stakeholders available. Uh, and I hope they take the message on board and do their homework.